Hello, it's Clinton here with ClickFunnels, and in this video, we are going to add an input form to your page. So, you're going to need a Click ClickFunnels page of some type. I'm using a blank template opt-in page. Um, if we're going to use this as a lead opt-in page, we want to make sure that we're going to set set up the integration settings. Okay, we're not going to do that in this video, but I just want to you know put it out there that you need to make sure that you have your integration set. So when you do submit the form, the information goes to where you want it to go. That includes your email service provider or Actionetics or what have you. All right, so the first thing that we're gonna do, we're going to add a new element. So let's go over to this headline and we're gonna click on the plus sign to add a new element. The element that we're gonna add, let's just do the email address. So we're gonna click on form over here on the right, input, we have the email address. Now let's do one more. Now there's a couple ways we can do it. We can click on the button we can go to form and we can go input or we can go clone and add a duplicate of what we created. So let's do this here. Let's go and edit some things here. So we're using the email address, but let's do let's change some settings on it. <clears throat> let's say we want to capture the first name first. So we're going to click on the sprocket. And we want the first name. So we need to change the text. All right, we're going to change it to first name. Now we're not going to make this a requirement. Now the next thing we want to do is we want to make sure that this input type is set for the email address. All right? So we have the first name and we're using the email address. All right? Now, the last thing that we need to do is make sure that we add a button in order to submit the form. So we're going to click on the plus sign here. We're going to go to form and we're going to go to button and we can choose a variety of different ways how we want to submit this form and what the action the form will take we can choose submit form open a pop-up go to a website url go to the next page in the funnel scroll down or up on the page and we can hide stuff elements for this particular form let's click submit form now let's make sure everything looks good on the inside I'm just doing a quick review everything looks good let's always save it whenever you make changes inside of ClickFunnels let's make sure you save it so everything looks good to go congratulations you have successfully completed the input uh, element using a form here inside of ClickFunnels if you need additional support at any time please reach out to ClickFunnels support uh, at the bottom of this page and I look forward to talking to you in the next video. Have a great day and go be awesome.